Hey everyone, welcome back to the Saga of Gamer Dad. So glad all of you could join me today. Hope everyone had a fantastic weekend uh, full of great gaming events and uh, just uh, good times all around. Hope everyone's safe and just really enjoyed their weekend and is ready to get back at it. Uh, today we are going back to The Legend of Keepers by Goblin Studio. I really felt like it was a great game and a great adventure uh, so I'm going back into it and I hope everyone enjoys uh, now that uh, we're in chapter 2 of the Legend of Keepers they do switch out our employees so we don't have the same people we had last time so now now we're looking at some new characters uh, which is real sad to me in a way I miss my skeleton Mel uh, she was hardcore so, but let's get at it. Uh, they're throwing us at either adventurers or veterans. And let's see. Uh, we got frozen caves or a stronghold. Heroes, monster, monster, either way. You know what? I mean, I know our or monsters or new monsters now but I'm, let's let's start this off with veterans i don't see them getting past mog so let's do this let's get at them all right so let's see who they threw at us they got rose and herbalist okay and rose the herbalist does some nature damage she heals Ooh, rose is gonna be a problem oh and she can't be affected by poison well rose you are gonna be a problem Wilhelm, the minstrel. So he does nature damage as well and applies dodge to the hero with the lowest life. Oof. That's going to be annoying. And Ice Wizard. So we got 100 and just low ice damage, randomly moves all monsters, so it does not matter what order we put them in to begin with. Initial duration of penalties received decrease it by one turn with a minimum of one. I really get annoyed by the wizards randomly <laughs> moving all monsters, but okay. So since this is the start, you know, not much strategy. Um, they all have nature resistance negative 35 to ice so let's go ahead and throw a mortar in there and then of course if that wizard's still there it's not gonna matter what order we put them in but we do have some new characters so let's check out uh some of the couple of the new ones here for bog um is level one but same type of character we had uh last time but now we've got a satyr, a metros, which does na nature damage and negative morale. And a succubus, uh, or a snell, I don't know. <laughs> it does fire damage, nature damage, and attacks ricochet to the hero position behind the target if the target's armor is positive. Okay. And then we'll do nature and each so might as well do that and of course mob so let's get this started let's see who they got up boom I switches them around oh it's a little singing jerk all right let's do the goblin trick boom hit that wizard with some pain right away rats no Ooh, Blizzard. Oh, they've almost got us. Yeah. Okay, but didn't take anyone out yet. So, persecution, fire damage to all of them, except for that little nerd there. Okay, protect, protective strike. Okay, a little damage. I have the feeling they're all going to make it to Mog. And then Mog's going to have to lay the smack down. All right, so they make it through the first group with little damage. Boom. Okay. Um, 
not much morale damage, so you know what? I'm just gonna boost up my next group of characters. Enraged! Alright. So let's see what we have here. Mischief, 23 nature damage, a negative 23 morale spreads two stacks from all penalties applied to the target to other uh, to another random hero, and that affects the back. And confusion implies same thing, um, but to the front. So since we have some penalties on the back, but oh wait, he's got. Dodge. Dodge's next attack. So I guess this one. Mm, rats again. Yeah. You know, if they weren't monsters, I would think that they would be scarier. You know what I mean? Infernal kiss. Fire damage. Ooh, hit that next one. I mean, these heroes have to think that they're just so tough. Like, facing these terrifying monsters. And, oh, we're so tough. We're facing a satyr and a succubus and a big old orc. And, oh, we're so bad. I hate them. I hate them so much. Look at them. They're barely... Boom. Take that. Mmm, Cleva. I hope you bleed to death. <laughs> oh no. There, yep. Alright, so here's where they make it through my second group. Trap is gonna do some damage. Alright. Now here is where things get real for them. They may have made it to Mog, but they are not making it out with a penny of that treasure. So, let's see. 80 physical damage. Yeah. Oh, and all of a sudden things got real. You think rats bother Mog? You think rats bother Mog? Are you kidding me? Whiplash, but ow! There goes that one. So. Oh, he's got little. Wait, is he? Okay. There. Okay. I was to say, is he going to dodge every attack? Because that's going to cause a problem. <laughs> Boom! It is done! Oh, I've never seen some of these psycho imps! Oh my gosh! What? Okay, I gotta check this out! I've never seen some of these characters before! Alright, so gargoyle we've seen before, but like, man, that gargoyle is cool looking. Look at those horns. Oh, it's ripped! This gargoyle hits the gym for sure. Like, I just feel like this gargoyle like flies up and is just like, "Do you even lift, bro? Do you even lift? Like, look at it. Oh man. Okay, so gargoyle area hits all the enemies. 18 air damage and negative 12 morale. That damage is not great. Front. 45 air damage applies bleeding times three. Now, that's a useful ability, but only 60 hit points, five morale. Yeah, like not the best there. Psycho imps. Look at these. Oh, I love them. Okay. Only 50 hit points though. 
But 18 physical damage applies bleeding 1, negative 30 morale, ricochets to the hero position behind the target. The target's morale is under 50%. Okay. And Furukuchi Ona. I'm probably saying that wrong, but Megumi. Negative 30 morale applies tiredness 2. Neg 30 ear damage applies vulnerability. Like. She's cool, like, but let's see, 80 health, 50, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, I so want, like, I don't even know which one I want to get, like, they all need improvement for sure, for sure, but, you know what? I've never seen Psycho Imps before. I'm just I'm getting them just because of that. They look so crazy and terrifying. Okay, motivation is down. All right, so we got engineer collectors an event. We do not have like the blood to pay off the collectors and stuff. So or the money, and I don't want to. So we're doing an event. Okay. Goldthor the Destroyer, do you have a moment to spare to talk about our Lord and Tormentor, Goldthor the Destroyer? <gasps> our Lord and Tormentor? Yes, I will. Oh. Plus, it gives us some motivation. But they're just like talking up, come in, talking all the little monster characters, reminding them of how their Lord and Tormentor, Goldthor the Destroyer, Black Market. We don't have any monsters to sell, so event again. A shifty looking supplier is offering you some human thighs to feed your employees at a discount price. They don't look or smell particularly fresh, but you know that management would grant you a sweet salary bonus for reducing overheads. Well, I think we know from last time that doing the thigh supplier immediately in like I mean the next time you have an event it's gonna be that you have food poisoning for some of your characters and it's gonna take them out of play or you have to pay gold to like get them the potion and such to recover them or else out for like a number of weeks but at the same time it's 300 gold <laughs> <laughs> Plus, I mean, you know, yeah, I just, I, what can I say? I like, I like helping out, you know, these people who are helping butcher people. Let's see, alchemist, transmute blood or tears into another resource. Not even useful yet. We only have 17 blood. Food poisoning. Oh, look at that. The off-smelling human thighs you accepted were served in the canteen. And so. Sorry, they're unavailable for five weeks, which puts us one monster short, I believe. How many monsters do we have? We have one, two, we have seven. Yeah, that would put us one monster short. For an invasion, okay, right. So let's see. Healing still gives us a hundred gold extra. Ignore. I'm taking a risk here. <laughs> taking a big risk. Black market. Sell monsters no longer useful. I didn't mean to listen. Okay, so I might have clicked on that on accident. <laughs> but oh well, we'll leave it. That's fine. Alright. So, we got a monster. We need to build up our monsters. Hey. Oh, yeah, we are monster short. Alright, it's fine. We're doing adventurers. Even if they make it to Mog, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Oh, we got the disciple, barbarian, 
and an elf with in like bandages. Okay. Heals 25% of heroes maximum life after a fight once. Okay, that's annoying. The call. The barbarian. Alright, so let's check out the weaknesses. Strong against nature, weak against fire. Strong against fire, weak against ice and nature. Weak against fire, weak against armor. Strong against ice. Boom. Uh, looks like. The mortar, because the mortar hits the back person, and the back person is weak against fire, so we're doing that. So they don't have anyone to switch characters around. What's this now? Passive damage and morale taken from traps reduced by 50%. Awesome, okay. Remove the penalty with most stacks. Enraged, okay. So let's see what we got here. 100, 100. So he's going in front. Uh, boom. Terrifying little imps here. Oh, I love them. I love them so much. Okay, now we got another trap. So this time, why not? Poison cloud. Okay. fact is they're, they're almost definitely going to make it through all of these guys and to Mog. But Mog's going to destroy them, so not too worried. Yeah. Goblin trick. Boom. Oh, that was a good amount of damage. Oh, murderous madness! Front negative thirty morale. What's his morale? Two ten. Oh, oh, oh! Yes, murder. Okay. We're gonna hit her with okay, protective strike. Oh, that chubby little. Kung Fu Master. <laughs> I just like terrifying them with my little imps. Chubby little Kung Fu Master is going to beat them down. Boom. Oh, the blood. The gore. I love it. I love it. Okay, poison trap. A little bit effective. Not too effective, but a little bit effective. Okay, intimidation. We're gonna hit him with some morale damage here. I do not like. <laughs> All right, mischief. He's weak to fire, strong against nature. Fire damage. Take that. We're gonna hit them. These guys are gonna drop. I'm actually starting to get a little bit nervous about some of these characters. Oh my gosh, he just exploded that succubus. Just like boom. Okay. Confusion. Like that person's their elf is definitely going to go down, but... Congrats! You've come right on time to your funeral! Yeah! That's what I like to hear. Okay. Okay, so just a couple more attacks and he's out, right? So that's good. We'll take out jean -Jay. jean -Jay? I'm not sure. Jan, uh, you know I'm I'm gonna I'm just messing it up. I'm killing that. So uh, we're gonna take out the. Ooh, you think you're so cool? I'm gonna murder 
these guys. Well, I'm mostly gonna scare them off. That's what I'm gonna do. Alright, so he's out. Run, chubby. Okay. Barbarian. So, let's see. Whiplash, 80 damage. Oh, challenge, boom. Barbarian's gonna be out in no time. What I like about this is we'll get some tears, definitely. Uh, and depending on if I kill the elf or scare her off, we'll get some blood as well. 80 damage. Um, yeah, we'll just kill the elf. Boom. To decorate my home. Oh man, we got more. Oh, this is awesome. Okay, Time Watcher, thirty-five air damage applies. Slowed two ricochets to the hero position behind the target. The target is slower. Sixty health area. Fifteen air damage deals ten percent. Target's current morale. Target is slower than the Time Watcher. Nice. Okay. Negative 30 morale plus tiredness, 30 ear damage, plus vulnerable, bore man, 50 physical damage plus broken armor, nice, armor reduced by 40, okay, 38 physical damage, 50% chance to apply stunned, 100, nice, I'm, I'm gonna go for the time watcher, I like the time watcher, I like some of these, oh man, buy a monster or a trap. I do have a bunch of gold, so yeah, absolutely. Dude, possessed armor. Um, uh, oil twenty fire damage applies fire weak. Yeah, okay. Can I only buy one? Oh, possessed armor. Oh no, I can't. I can buy more than one. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Herpy. Okay, let's um, psychoaps again and poison dart. I'm gonna buy Brugo. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, man. Let's see, work out. Some intensive sessions at the gym. Master has to stay fit. Mm. Let's go event. Let's see what's happening in the. One of your traps didn't pass the last mandatory. Checkup. You can call a repairer to come at your expense or send it for five weeks to the technical department who will fix it for free. If you have the appropriate artifact, you can, of course, repair it immediately. Huh. Repair at my expense. Yeah, just send it to the technical department because why would I. Trainer. Oh, man. I cannot wait to get some of these guys leveled up. They're going to be so awesome. Okay, so. <laughs> plus 15, plus 10, nature. Front, 60 damage, consume stacks of burn, applied to the target. Okay. That's what we got here. Passive attacks, which should. Mm -hmm. 200 let's get some of these okay train 175 um, absolutely training him uh -huh. 388 or 250 I mean 250 150 you're getting trained um, 175, 150, 100, train. Okay. Alchemist. Now we don't need to transmute an event again. Understaffing. The R&D manager needs a guinea pig to test a new trap. He's asking you to provide him with one of your employees in exchange for some gold. Um...
No, I'm not gonna. That's your bad man, R&D manager. Veterans, veterans, champion. Okay. Uh, I am not healed up all the way. I don't really want to risk a champion yet. Um, artifact, trap. Let's go for an artifact. Like, mm, that's a lot less gold though. 50 to 85 gold in an artifact trap. <laughs> I like getting that gold, yo. Gotta get paid. Okay. So we're in the polar caverns again. These ice caverns. Adventurers coming in. Let's see who they got. They've got a novice. A little chubby novice. Level 3. Gal. 43 ice. Well, at least he's prepared for ice, you know. He's got, he does ice damage, he's resistant to ice, um, not really resistant to fire though, only their, uh, only their concert is resistant to fire, can't be affected by demoralized, oh, okay, so he's not real. he's, the little bard character here is, uh, good for, uh, st uh, preventing, you know, like morale attacks, and they have a priestess, so replaces one of her penalties with a bonus at the start of her turn. Okay, mm. he plays dodge. Okay, I all right. So they, their party is not the strongest for for a veteran party but they've got some good skills to help each other but so we're gonna start it with the oil cauldron then we are going to <laughs> okay we're gonna let's see here we're gonna bring out Virgo Edward and let's see bring out a fell okay then bring out poison cloud then we're going to bring out Bug. I want to bring out some of my new characters here. So we got Stell and let's see. This haste two monsters in front of the harpy. So let's bring out her. And of course, big old Mog. The manager. Oh, enjoy that burning oil. Uh. La, la. Shut up. Your music's terrible. Persecution. Oh, oh you think you're cool? Yeah. Shadow Fist, 20 physical damage, and negative 49 morale, applies terrified. And that does to the back, or flame strike. 14, negative 14 morale. Then it's dealt double if the target is affected by burn. <laughs> All right, your little music attack took down my orc, but enjoy those flames. I'm just getting you ready for so you know what hell feels like. 
I love the dragon in the background, just the dragon skeleton. All right, here they come. Oh, look, they got a little camp here. Poison. Man, like a frozen ship. That's so cool. Take out the front guy. Okay, let's see if we can take them out before they get to mobs this time. Let's hit him with that to begin with. Waste of time. 42 of damage applies slowed. Okay. Like that. Yeah. Dude, I think we're going to take him out before they get to Mog this time. Alright, guys. Good job. Oops, I'm turning. We're willing that take out that one. We will oh, that'll take out that one. And waste the time. Boom! Awesome. Good job, everyone. Yes. Poisonous plant. Twenty nature damage to the area plus nature weakness four. Negative 30 pile of bones. Negative 35 morale. Ricochets to the hero position behind the target. Let's go with poisonous plant. Okay, so that a little loss in motivation, but they're all still good. Uh, let's check out. The, let's check out plunder. What can we plunder this time? Okay. Let's see, so, uh, Disreputable Tavern, risk of unavailability, 100%, three volunteers for two weeks. Ew, okay. Two weeks are out. And guild cost, or gold cost, 100, volunteer, plus one. Okay, and find a monster, 100%. So, we get gold, we get plus one motivation. We find a monster, but we lose three for two weeks. Risk of injury, 35%. One volunteer for 10 weeks. Get motivation one. Set a monster free, 75%. Risk of being haunted crib, gold. 35% one volunteer 10 weeks. Fun non effect. Hmm. hmm. I'll do this one. Guarded prison. Let's see what we got. Your volunteers have snuck into a prison and left a trail of blood on their way out. They fa even found a monster in the cage and set them free. They have emerged unscathed. Yes! Alright! So we got ourselves a new monster employee, Smon the Seder. Uh, they get plus one motivation. Sounds good. Good job. All right. Let's see. So, sanctuary. That's gonna. That makes uh, like a curse on adventurers. It's possibly good. Trainer. Don't have a lot of gold. We could train like one, maybe two monsters. Business trip, choose an employee to protect the sales department during a business trip. We get a bonus. Um, I'm going to do Sanctuary. Let's see. The efficient is waiting for your instructions and your offerings to start the ritual. Which curse will you bestow upon the humans for the next few months? Let's see what we got here. Penalty. Bleeding. Have to pay 20 blood. Penalty. Elemental weakness. Resistance is reduced by 20. 15 blood, 10 tears. Penalty. 15 nature damage on the next turn. 
I'm gonna go with the elemental weakness uh, because so many of my guys have elemental abilities and a lot of times they have some weaknesses so boom just gonna in improve that okay event the ninth door Gulthor demands blood quench his thirst and he will send one of his most dreadful avatars into the mortal world summons a random monster of demon type negative 240 life by choosing the ritual or offer tank. Mm, dang, I really want, I guess I'll go for it. Who did I get? Did I not get a character? Or, oh, I must have gotten this guy. Did I get, is this who I got? 27 fire damage at two stacks of. Let me see. Yeah. Oh, man. Not worth it. Not worth it. I was hoping for, like, someone really awesome. But since we have so many characters now, um, let's see. He's down two. So. Go ahead and swap him. He can go. He can go out for a little bit. Rest, you know. I'm gonna keep Korg there for another turn. But bring him there. And yeah, that looks good. All right. Okay, so adventurers, adventurers. Let's see. Trap, monster, master bonus. Um, you know what? Like, I would do the veterans because it gives more gold and stuff. But I just don't want to do the frozen cave again. So we're defending the stronghold this time. <laughs> All right. Let's see what they got. Oh my gosh, this guy looks cool. He's a ninja, Rafar. Okay, and act, they sent an actual ninja. Awesome. Twenty-seven nature damage applies poison. Applies elemental weakness. Nature defense seventy-five percent. Weak against fire, though. Mm, not good news for you. Okay. Let's see. 30 physical damage. Applies broken armor 3. Applies enraged. Um, weakens ice. Okay. Weakens fire. Negative armor. Healing. Let's see. Okay. Alright. So we're going to start with the oil cauldron. Confirm. Now for our monsters here. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna bring out let's see. And then actually no. I'm sorry. Uh remove. We're gonna bring out Brugo. Brugo has nature resistance and oh, I love these little psycho imps, but I'm gonna bring no, I'll bring them in the guy. Yeah. Confirm. Okay, now, nature resistance down, no nature resistance, negative fire, let's see, 10, you know what, 
I believe this guy's dead anyway. And if he's not, the others will take damage. Ooh, got someone cooking. Mmm. Delicioso. Okay, I'm going out for a bog. Uh, you know what? We're going to bring out... So, and then... The succubus. This time. Why not? I don't see any of these jerks making it to Mog, but even if they do, they're not going to stand a chance. <laughs> oh. Persecution. Enjoy those flames. Okay, Cleaver. Oh yeah. Don't die yet. Okay, twenty one. Nope. Enjoy those flames. Yeah. Alright, did a good job of taking out my first team. But now they have to face Heat Wave? Yeah. Heat Wave. Oh yeah. Can I trap? Boom. And enrage from the next group. They're not making it through the next group. Yeah, no! this is gonna be sweet. Let's see, waste of time. Infernal kiss. Cleaver. <laughs> Enjoy waste of time and you know what just because it's different. Yeah yeah Let's see okay. Let's see Pandora's box. Negative ten morale stacks of all penalties applied to heroes increased by two. Awesome. Okay. Uh cursed prism. Applies elemental weakness three. Okay, resistance is reduced by twenty. All right, and polar portal. Okay, so this is uh, you know what? I'm, I'm gonna go with the cursed prism. So we need to trade out some people, get them some rest. So let's do that now. Oh yeah. They're nice and uh, go head out there, bro. Good job, good job. Get our characters here in. Let them heal up. Let's see, work out. Yeah, why not? Let's work out. <laughs> Yoga, <laughs> skipping rope. Sauna. Okay. I guess... <laughs> I guess we're doing yoga. Yeah, man. Okay, let's get some plunder. Why is... I'm wondering why Edward is... Like when he's in the garrison, I'm surprised that these are an available thing, but whatever. Um, it's Coventry, someone's getting injured definitely for three weeks. Uh, but the volunteers get plus two morale, and the next dungeon, haste for all monsters. Okay, isolated farm five percent injury 
one volunteer, but you get some gold. 52 to 73, not a lot. Uh, and pilgrimage site. Let's see. 75% chance all there'll be tiredness for all monsters. 30% chance of an artifact. Gold gain 73 to 105. Not worth it. Uh, yes, the breed farm. Volunteers have savagely plundered a neighboring cattle farm, but in their joy, Edward ate much in six three weeks of his stomach to calm down. Hopefully, they've taken with them enough fresh and bloody flesh to stimulate your troops. Haste three applied to all monsters for the next dungeon, plus plus two morale. Motivation for the next, or for all the monsters involved. So, boom. Not bad. Not bad. Let's do the event. Let's see what's happening at work. Here at work, a trainee has spilled a burning hot drink on you in front of the blood spice latte machine. Puck my life. 120 damage taking. <laughs> Let's see. Blood? Or uh, insult them. Uh, health is getting a little low. Doesn't feel like it's going up with those. Uh, workout. We're hitting the event again. Let's see what's Icarus. What's this? Wizard with a strange chat has fallen from the sky and landed in the entrance hall. He was carrying a magical artifact. Monsters place at the back perform an additional attack but lose negative 20 speed and start fights with negative 50% of their maximum life. Sell. So, not worth it. Okay. Trap. Good gold. Um, trap. Also solid gold for adventurers. Um, I'm doing this one. Alright, let's check out what they got here, because they got some Onomusha, looks like they got a samurai type looking guy here, with a spear, a sorceress, and a harpooner, so uh, these adventurers are starting to get real hardcore, and, and real awesome looking, like I haven't seen a harpooner before, that's awesome. And I haven't seen an Onomusha before, and they're awesome looking as well. 67 fire damage, gains flame shield, applies elemental weakness, 480 hit points. Okay, I feel like the only way to really deal with these ones is going to be to attack the morale because they all have less morale than they have hit points um, for most of them significantly the um, harpooner definitely has almost as much morale as it points but none of the other ones are even close so and this one's immune to master spells okay so let's see what we got here All right, negative morale. Negative morale. Okay. What's this one weak to? This one's weak to fire. Okay. So bring in Appel, and then we'll do bring in um, and we will bring in my psycho imps. Okay. Now for a trap here, let's see what we got here. Hmm, none of my traps really do mor or do morale. So let's you know let's give them an elemental weakness. I think that's probably one of the most useful things we can do right now. Okay, 
And then after giving them or weakening them elementally, let's go ahead and hit them with fire. Okay. And then let's see. Okay. And then Let's see, 30 fire damage, 20 nature, 42 air damage, apply slowed, tired, let's do stuff. Ah, oh gosh, I'm going to be really annoyed if I end up getting beaten. <laughs> okay. Okay. So back, 18 nature damage, negative 18 morale, spreads two stacks from all penalties applied to target. Okay. Passive can't be affected by poison. Nature. Weaker. So I'm going to hit confuse it. Murderous madness. Fire. <laughs> that was a serious attack. Ooh. Ah, gosh, they are serious. They are serious. Oh, man, they got a spear with a rocket on it. A spear with a rocket on it. Man, I am hitting them with all the morale stuff I could get, and it's barely... Oh, gosh, okay. I'm starting to get them. Oh. I'm starting to get the morale down a bit, but oh, uh, I don't like the looks of this. I do not like the looks of this. I right, here it comes. Who dares disturb my slumber? Hi, here it comes. <laughs> Dang! I think I made a mistake. I think I made a mistake. I should have tried to murder them. Oh gosh. Oh no, Mog got beaten. Mog got beaten. Not to worry. The Lich Doctor will bring you back to life. Losing a treasure here and there is allowed for in the annual budget. Well, wow, they're really reasonable. I'm stronger now. Well, that's good. 
Torture is a what? passion. A scar on his record. Let's go ahead and go to talents here. Let's see. Anything that... You know what? I mean, maybe we should give him shell. Like, you, I wasn't expecting most monsters to be able to get to him, but let's give him a chance for shell. Okay. All right. I think uh, that's a good place to uh, call it quits on this video. Uh, I hope uh, everyone's really enjoyed it and is looking forward to continue this week. Uh, this whole week we'll be playing legend of keepers uh, it's a really enjoyable game for anyone who hasn't played it uh, it's a fun management um, rpg game and i really enjoy it and i hope all of you continue uh watching and following along you know and if you enjoy the videos give it a like give it a subscribe click that bell always appreciated I uh, can't wait for all you to see all you gamers tomorrow and joining me uh, for this next video. Until next time, this has been Gamer Dad, and I'll see you then.